What's up everybody, Derek here, and today we are at a new place that I've never been to. Well, I shouldn't say that. I've been here one time, but the water was not where it's at right now. You can literally walk across to the other side. You see how far that is. But the crappie should be moving. The, this lake is up, so we should be able to make it back into the creek with the mud motor and the bass pelican here. So we're going after crappie. We could end up catching bass and catfish and crappie because we got minnows and when you go to the creek or the river, just about anything will hit minnows, but hopefully we can find these crappies stacked up and get on them and get a big stringer going. But let's go around this corner and go back in here and see if we can get into this creek. I'm hoping we don't have to drag, but oh, it's such a nice day out here. It feels like 70 degrees right now. So let's go fishing. Well, we are ready to take off out there, but we're going to have to be careful because there is some stunts and it is super shallow out here. So I'm going to have to make it out to the middle. Oh, uh, I'm hoping it's like three or four foot deep, but I think we can make it back into these creeks fairly easily. So let's take off. Start this thing up. Choke it. channel all right I could have probably made it with the mud motor going okay we're coming up on our first little drop off here right over in here is a bunch of sticks in the corner right here and it got down to eight foot and it's been three foot the whole time and we just came out of the end down there so I'm thinking this might be a good place to start right there with the the timber stuff nine foot. This is a good little hole. Oh, and it's gone. What is this? What do I got here? Oh, it's gonna get tangled up. That thing went down instantly. What do we got? It's fighting like a bass. Or a catfish. Catfish. Ma, ma. Ma. Might catch lots of kitties back in here. Oh my. Not what I was after, but at least we caught something. No. Thought I turned it off. I got a fish on there. Are you kidding me? It got hung up in the trolling motor and I got a fish on. <sighs> Catfish. Broke me off. Dang. That stinks. Thought I had my trolling motor off and it sucked in the line. I'm gonna get it on there outside edge see what happens it was shallowing up though 
gone. What do I got? Feels like a catfish. Wait, it's fighting. Huh? I don't know. We'll see here in a second. Sure is fighting like a catfish though. Yeah, because it's staying down. Let's see, is it a kitty? It sure is. Man, we are tearing some catfish up back in here, but it's not what I'm wanting to catch. Oh, that's a good one, too. Good little channel cat, right? Right. Man. Huh. Those would be some good fillets right there. Cut a crappie and I had my minnow dangling over the side of the boat. That was cool. Little guy, but I'm gonna have to let him go. Thanks, buddy. Well, that tells me they're in here. What did I have? That hit like a crappie. I caught a crappie and I had my minnow dangling over the side of the boat. That was cool. Little guy, but I'm gonna have to let him go. Thanks, buddy. Well, that tells me they're in here. Wow. Well, I was just getting a hit over there and I could have sworn it it hit like a crappie. And then I catch that one, so. Where there's one, there's more. Good. Caught one crappie right there. That's about it. One's better than none. Heck yeah. Oh yeah, I've got one right here. I'm planning on I'm planning on going up to Ray Roberts and going up in those creeks where it's just like this, and you can vertically jig them out of those treetops, oh, yeah. those laydowns. Oh my gosh, that's a crappie. Please be a big old crappie, big old crappie. I just knew it. I knew that was crappie that were hitting top right there. I've, I've known they're not that big, but they're just cruising around in here. Man, they are eating these hooks. Goodness. All right, let's see how big this one is. I think this one's a keeper. Oh, oh, and I about lost it. Yep.
10, 11. I am just gonna, I bet this whole section's got them in here. I've caught two now. Well, it's been a grind out here today. I mean, I haven't caught a lot of fish. I did catch those kitties. That was kind of fun. Found some crappie, and I found the spot that's actually right back there in that bend has so much action going on in it and I don't know what was special about it but seeing other places it was way different but as you see the sun just popped out it looks like kind of clear skies up in there but I keep hearing rumbling and other stuff I don't know if I've got a storm moving in on me I have no idea but we caught one and it's gonna be enough for a little fish sandwich so I'd have a fish sandwich out of one of these crappie any day but Anyways, let me know if you guys have trouble. I know if I was fishing this chocolate stuff, I mean, look look how dark that is. This chocolate stuff, it's hard to beat minnows when you go fishing. Of course, you can jig, jig it and jig it and jig it, but a lot of times if you want to find the fish, and especially since I've never been here in this creek before, I use minnows, and I think that was probably one thing that probably helped me because I probably wouldn't have caught anything if I was using jigs today. Just me guessing, but let me know what you guys think in the comments section. And subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video if you liked it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.